Officials have not released the names of every person killed, but details are emerging through their friends and family. CBS 11's Jennifer Lindgren joins us now with a look at how they're being remembered. Jen. Yeah, Russ, they range in age from 18 months old to 77 years old. People are grieving not only in Sutherland Springs, but beyond this tiny community and beyond Texas. Robert and Shani Corrigan are among the victims of the attack. Robert was an Air Force veteran. He and Shani had two sons, one of whom is also in the military. People in their hometown gathered for a vigil Monday night. The couple graduated from Harrison High School in Farmington Hills, Michigan, and later moved to Texas. They were members of the church in Sutherland Springs. Bobby was an amazing man. He was, and Shani was his post as I do, you know. They lost a young man that loved the military, that loved to serve his country. He was over 30 years in the service. Yeah. The pastor of First Baptist Church, Frank Pomeroy, and his wife were out of town when the shooting happened, but later learned their daughter was there and was killed. We're going to hear from those parents coming up at 6. Karen. Thank you, Jen.